Hey everyone, and welcome back. This is Outlaw 2044 with a review of a new game I'm trying out. Um, this is called um, uh, Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. It's kind of fun. Um, you know, as a kid, I I took apart my toys and I put them back together because I love to see how they work. And this is actually fairly accurate. I've done a brake replacement on my car before, and um, it's pretty good. So let's just back up a little bit here. So, so the idea of the game is, it's it's not a get rich thing. It's kind of like one of those games you play when you don't know, feel like killing zombies, right? So you just kind of relax and chill. So here's the workshop. Uh, you start off with a small workshop, but you, when you do the tutorial, you have a a huge workshop with all the bells and whistles. But this is a very small workshop that you start off with. And you're just doing stuff to gain experience. Like uh, right now, I'm just doing brake jobs, oil changes, and every now and then I'll get a story order, which uh, is part of the campaign of the game itself that has a little more speciality to it. Uh, and it's it's a fun game. It's it's relaxing. There's not a lot. There's no pressure or anything like that. Um, and everything has its use through the tutorial to show you how it is. And I, I feel actually pretty well knowledgeable about my car now. I mean, I've done a lot of car work already, and not all of this is new to me. And I've obviously, anybody that's been a mechanic has hung around and watched the mechanic do their thing. You kind of figure out what they're doing. Uh, but uh, so there's several modes to this game. Uh, right now, and there's the radio menu here. Couch right there. Settings, take a picture, take your orders, inventory, that kind of stuff like that. Uh, I'm still only fourth level right now. My XP is at. Uh, 1053. I've got four calls waiting, uh, which means orders. Let's take a look at those orders that I have. So this is so the idea is to uh, create or actually repair cars quickly and, and less expensively, so you can get it more speed. Now it doesn't matter if it's an expensive car or new parts, old parts that you're pla replacing it with. You're going to get XP, which is probably the same. Uh, actually, somebody mentioned it's about the same. So let, this one looks like it needs mineral parts, 63%. Okay, so let's take that order. Now there's no time. Oh, I have no space side. So you can only do so many cars at a time. So I got this one in my car now. So in my garage now. So let's um let's take a look at this. So right control here. And it's like car status tells you what's wrong with the car. So this is a story car. So story is a little different. Um, here it is. So it says story right here. And tells you that this is part of the campaign. So you get more XP and more money by doing story cards. Um, but not much apparently for XP. So wander around, uh, this is the lift. You can operate the lift and stuff like that. Look at the cars. And one of the cool things is that, for instance, um, I've already placed the brakes on here, but um, on that side. But see, it outlines what needs to be done here. So I go here. I know this one needs a brake pad because uh, I. It, the brake pads are actually fine. The brake pads were at uh, 82%. The caliper and the cylinder were around 80%. Uh, but the, the really bad part was the, uh, the the disc itself. So the, uh, let's see what they look like. Uh, this is the one I just pulled out of this car. So not, I'll sell it in a minute, but for now I'm not. But I do have a, a new one here. I can put it on this car. So I'm, I'm, um, right now I'm in um, detach mode, so if I click on a part, it'll remove it. So, now supposedly, if it's if it's red, it's supposedly bad. So, I'm not quite sure about that. Somebody had mentioned that in another video. I'm not quite 100% sure. But, I mean, sure, there's a lot of bad parts, but the guy wants a brake job, right? I'm not going to replace everything. So, let's take a look. Uh, let's see what the card status is. So... Brake pads on the other side have been fixed. Now I need to replace the caliper and the ventilated disc. So let's put this back on. I'll right click on it. I'll go on car mount mode. Now I click on here. And then I'm going to put a new one on there. Uh, now, when it says condition, see how this uh, 75%, 60%, whatever? Well, the order itself will tell you what's the percentage. So minimum repair part needs to be 80 percent at least so right now i'm only making 40 bucks so it's not a whole lot so um, it's the xp i'm after right now so uh, let's let's mount a part so click on that now here's the one i'm not 100 percent click on it it's going to fit it in there 
And now let's um, put these pads on there. We're going to put some. Well, we'll put the pads back on there. Again, the pads are 82% for them already. So. And now here's an 80% caliber. And the problem with that thing was 69%. So what I need is I need a um, I need an insight piece. So let's see if there's one that's higher. Okay, so there we go. So um, there's a cylinder, 91%. I think that's okay. Let's tighten it. Now the cool thing is you can rotate this, and you can look at the bolts and stuff like that. You know, it's funny this game doesn't have is uh, that I've noticed so far, and I'm just beginning it. Is that it doesn't have rusted on bolts that break when you're wrenching it. Uh, yeah, so that's a good thing. Uh, let's put this wheel back on and before I do that, let's see what So, and it's saying it still needs a new caliper, so it, it's probably the caliper on the other side. I'm going to replace that one. But yeah, so that's basically the game here. There's not a whole lot to, of fanciness going on. Now, later on, apparently, when you get higher levels, if you think you get you easier to run. So, so just to look. So there are different places. Here's my here's my garage here. You get workshop maps. There's different places you go. Now apparently later on when you're higher level in this junkyard you can get into it. I can't go to it right now. See, it's not letting me. But if I, some places I can go to. One of the junkyards now, one of them. You can go to um, people's homes and their and their garages and stuff like that, and their barns, and check out their cars there and buy them. So the idea is to buy the older cars, fix them up, restore them, and and, and sell them off. Uh, but you can do what you like, so um, there, there's, it's kind of free roam in that sense. Um, so that's it. So it's, it's it was on Steam for about uh, 25 bucks um, in the U.S., which is uh, pretty cheap. Um, you know, by picking up a game that you don't really need to do a whole lot with and just kind of chill and just take things apart and build them, uh, it's not so bad at all. Uh, Alright, so this is Outlaw 2044. Thank you for watching and um, enjoy this game. Pick it up on Steam if you like. Um, I'm on Discord. If you ever want to see me there? I'm usually hanging out with the zombie crowd in uh, Night of the Dead, uh, but at the moment uh, I'm not there. So um, have a good day and uh, talk to you guys later. Thanks.